I'm here with Joe, Rain City Modular. <laughs> so, <laughs> you got an interesting uh, sequencer thing going on here. Yep. Let me hear about it. All right. So what we've done is deconstructed the sequencer into component parts. It's called the sequencer construction set. Uh, you have a clock buffer here that drives a clock to all of the modules in the suite. We have an eight-step voltage sequencer, a six-step or sixteen-step uh, trigger sequencer, and then a dual sequential switch. And put together, you basically can build as big a sequencer as you want, or as small a sequencer as you want, or use them as utility modules. So you could take a, the trigger sequ or the voltage sequencer, and you can use it as a modulation source or a complex envelope generator. You could use trigger sequencers to do, create pulse trains and clock divisions for other modules. Uh, there's a lot of really interesting flexibility you can use in this. So I'm going to go ahead and start this up right now. It's going to be a little noisy. So what we have. First is these two se sequencers here are pushed through the sequential switch to create a 16-step pattern, and that gives us our lead line through the analog voice on the on the synthesizer I have up here. Then I have these trigger sequencers here running my drum voice. One of these sequencers is running through the 1010 music bit box, and that's uh, giving you the hi hats. Then we have this sequencer here which is giving you the drums coming out of one of the Pico drums. And then we have a second kick that's going through another trigger sequencer to run the back kick. And that's basically what I've got patched up here. Now some interesting parts of this sequencing system will be uh, that we have dynamic editing. When you've stopped the system, you can actually jump around and edit the sequence as you need to. So instead of having to clock through the system, you can just basically jump to the correct step. Uh, these can be one shot or looped, and you can also apply a clock from the front panel if you don't want to clock it from the bus behind. You can control step length across all of these as well as sequence length. And also on the trigger sequencers, we have a ratchet mode, which will allow you to have up to eight pulses per step. Uh, so you can create Tangerine Dream style ratcheting from like the Phaedra era and the Poland era. So that's pretty much it on the basic stuff. So thank you. Cool, play it again and show us some of that. All right, sweet. So, we'll go ahead and turn off some of these bass drums. And we'll turn this down a little bit. There we go. A little more burbling, a little less of that. And then we'll also adjust some of these hi-hats here. There we are. And one of the other interesting things about this while we're playing is when you change the uh, sequence length or the step length, it doesn't take effect until the next bar comes around, until the next step one goes. So if you want to speed things up or slow things down, you can do it in a very musical manner. So let's show you this. So change the sequence length here from 16 to eight steps, and then it changes when it goes back around. So it'll finish the step, it'll finish the 16 step pattern, and then it'll go back. So really, really fun stuff there. So yep. are these available now? To uh, they will be available by fall. We're just beginning our mass production run right now. Uh, the, we have a starter set that includes uh, enough for a 16-step sequencer. Uh, this is $700. Then we have each of these. These are 200. Uh, the voltage sequencers are $200 a piece. The trigger sequencers are $150 a piece. And the uh, sequential switch is $150 as well. The clock buffer is $60. So, and and yeah. where, do, where do people go? That they uh, want we're selling things? them direct right now, but we're always interested in doing dealers. So uh, we're going to be starting to talk to people as soon as we have some consistent production in the pipeline. Great. So yep. uh, website? Uh, www.raincitymodular.com. Awesome. Yep. Thanks, cool. Joe. No problem.